Fact or myth, is wearing someone else's glasses bad for you? I'm gonna answer that question and more coming up. I'm Dr. Rupa Wong, board certified ophthalmologist. And on this channel, we talk about eye health, eye surgery, and eye makeup health. So if any of that interests you, if you wouldn't mind taking just a moment to hit that subscribe button so you can get all of the most up-to-date eye health and eye surgical health topics right when I put them out. Okay, so let's go back to this. Everyone always thinks that wearing someone else's glasses is going to injure their eyes. Is it true or not? Well, it's kind of true. This is a yes and no type of answer, and I'll explain. If you're an adult, wearing someone else's glasses will actually not harm your vision. It might give you headaches, eye fatigue, eye strain, of course, blurred vision, might even give you some double vision, nausea, all of those things are possible. But if you are over the age of 18, wearing someone else's glasses is not going to hurt you long term. And the reason for that is because glasses don't actually change the shape of your eyeballs. So even though it can feel really uncomfortable and feel like you're straining, if you're wearing someone else's glasses and they're not the right prescription for you, you're not going to be able to see clearly, but you're not going to do any permanent long-term damage. If you are Googling this question, is wearing someone else's glasses bad? You'll probably find a ton of stuff online that says, no, this is a myth. It's totally not bad. It just feels uncomfortable. And that's what I just said, right? Except for the fact that I said yes and no. So I'm gonna explain the whole yes part. So here's the caveat. If you are a child, so anyone younger than 18, really it's gonna be like younger than 13 or 14, and the child is wearing somebody else's glasses or a prescription that's not accurate for them, that can cause long-term damage. And the way that happens is it can cause something called amblyopia. So I'm not just an ophthalmologist, I'm actually fellowship trained in pediatric ophthalmology, which means I take care of kids all day long. So this one is near and dear to my heart. And I see this a lot. Sometimes kids break their glasses, they lose their glasses, and they are either using a really old prescription, which might not be accurate, or they're using their like brothers or sisters, or heck, I've even seen them using grandma's glasses once. So this is why it can be dangerous for children to do this. If it's a wrong prescription, they're gonna be experiencing the same thing adults do, blurred vision, headaches, eye fatigue, eye strain. But that's not what I'm worried about. In kids, this is the really critical period of their visual development. So what happens is when you are a child from birth to about even now they think 13 to 15 years of age, the optic nerve connections are forming from the retina to your brain. So you are continuously forming these connections when you're a kid and it strengthens the vision or can weaken the vision depending on what your eye sees. This is why an eye that crosses in or wanders out, it's not a, just a cosmetic thing in children. If the eye is actually wandering, that can cause poor vision. If the vision is not clear in one or both eyes when you're a child, then those connections do not strengthen between the retina and the optic nerve and the back of the brain, the occiput, where the vision centers of your brain lie. So this is where it's a problem for kids. If they're wearing a glasses prescription that makes everything blurry, as opposed to the one that makes their vision clear, then what's their brain getting? It's getting a very blurred image. And then the brain doesn't understand that. And it doesn't make strong connections to the eyes. And the result of that is if kids end up wearing those wrong glasses for a long period of time, it can cause permanent damage. Meaning once we switch them out to the correct pair of glasses, then it might even take months or even years to get the vision to back up to where it should be. That is all about the amblyopia. So this is where you really don't want a child wearing an incorrect glasses prescription or someone else's glasses because it can really cause some serious harm since their visual system is still developing. When I say all of that for kids, I'm not, again, talking about wearing someone else's glasses for five minutes or 10 minutes or heck, even an hour. I'm talking when kids are wearing someone else's glasses or a wrong prescription 
for days or weeks or months. That's what I'm talking about. That's how long it takes to really sustain that kind of long-term damage of amblyopia. So as we get older and we get outside of that critical period, then the visual system of the brain gets just a little less plastic. And by that, I mean, it just doesn't change as much. So initially they used to think that critical period was up until about age nine or 10. And now later studies have actually shown it might even go as long as to like age 13 or 14. So that's why I would say anybody older than 15, 16, you are fine if you really want to wear someone else's glasses for a short period of time. It's just gonna make you really uncomfortable and not like the way that things look. But if it's a kid or a tween or even a teenager, a 13 or 14 year old, it can do long-term damage, but you'd have to be wearing them for a really substantial amount of period of time. So there you go, that myth was answered. Kind of busted and kind of not busted. I know, right in the middle. But hopefully that gave you a little bit more information in case you were wondering about this question. And if you wouldn't mind before you go, just taking a minute to like this video, let me know if you've ever tried wearing someone else's glasses, if it was good or not, or if you have any questions about anything that I discussed. Until next time, I'm Dr. Rupa and it was good to see you. Bye-bye. <music>